All right, some people were wondering what this circuit was over here that uh, some previous owner had put in. Not the beeper, I put in the beeper, but uh, there was a socket here and, and some LEDs here. What I figured out was this socket was actually used with a, uh, a dip switch here, so you can input. So this, this will be an input, so whatever value was on this switch, the computer could read. And then this is just a driver chip. This is just being used to drive the LEDs, but it's connected to one of the ports. So this is, this is actually port zero and this is port one. So we could write a routine to read the value of this port and write it here. So I think that's what the exercise was uh, when, they, uh, when they did this. Maybe it was a class exercise, um, most likely could have been uh, or maybe somebody was just trying to learn. So uh, I wrote a program. So let's go to 2000. Oops, 2000. All right, so 2000 is memory here and I've wrote, I've written a program. So at 2000, I have 3E, which is load accumulator direct with FF. Now you have to program the ports for output. They default to input but you need, if you're going to output, you need to turn them on. So we're going to, we're going to need to write FF, which is one, 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 one to the control port for port, uh, one. All right. So next we are going to, I think I went too far. Yeah. Let me see here. The buttons are a little flaky on this thing. All right. Next. Okay. There we go. There we go. Now we're going to do an output to, ah, and I did it again. All right. All right, so if I can do this next. So load accumulator with FF output to port three. We're going to output to port three, which is the control port for port one. Now we're going to do a DB, which is an input on port zero. We're going to read port zero. We're going to output it. To port one, which is over there. And then we're going to do a jump to 2000. So we're going to, we're going to loop. Okay. So you do go 2000 execute. Uh, I think it's running. Let's see. Yes. So, uh, I think you can see that if I, if I flip a switch here, the led flips over here, right? So, I can turn all the LEDs off, flip all the switches down. All right. So that might be hard to see. I'm going to turn on uh, the red LED there. I'm going to turn on that red LED there. And I turn on the red, that red LED there. So you can see that I'm reading from these switches and writing to those LEDs. So that's what this was over here. It's a nice little exercise, write your own code. And uh, once again, we can look at the code uh, at 2000. Uh, load accumulator with FF, output it to port three, which is the control port. So set control port to output. We're going to read port zero and then output port one and loop. There you go.